Here comes Keith to the T9. What are you doing? I'm putting my boat in the water. You're putting your boat in the water? Oh yeah. What kind of boat is that? TU9. TU9, baby. Oh yeah. All right. <laughs> The tunnel plank of the boat had begun to separate at the front and hung a quarter inch from the mahogany trim piece it was originally epoxy to. When the boat plowed a wave, it bent back the tunnel plank until it broke at the nail line. The old piece was cut off and a cut line was made, and a new piece was cut and fit into place. All surfaces were then sanded and prepped for fiberglassing. And the new piece is fiberglass in place with the West system using as many clamps as we had. The front was then sanded flush and prepped for painting. And it was repainted with two coats of black paint to finish the repair.
Pause it, right? Last day of boating for 2012. Uh, today is the 20th of October, and uh, as you can see, there's not too many people here at the ramp at about one in the afternoon on you know, Saturday. There's that Beaver Lake in uh, Derry, New Hampshire. Let's head down to the ramp here, see how many people are using the ramp today. Looks like there's one boat. TU9. Got the ramp all to itself today. I don't need to pull it up on the rocks over here. You can just pull it right up to the ramp. No waves, doesn't rock around. Looks pretty dead out there. I see no other boats. Beautiful day. It's probably 68 degrees right now. Nice calm glass water. Got about five gallons of gas to run through this boat and then it's going away in storage. So, cheers to an awesome last day on the water, 2012.
That's how you do it right there. <laughs> it doesn't seem like it goes that fast, but when you're on it, it's flying. Oh yeah, yeah, when you're on it, it gets uh, it gets fast. There's Jim Moffat, who showed up at Beaver Lake today on the last day of boating for me. With his 1951 Firestone, right? Yeah. 5152, alright. Looking awesome, Jim.